Hey, Tony Kegger here, and I'm going to try to do a live reactions video to a match I'm about to watch. It's going to be a SummerSlam match that I'm watching for the Summer Wrestling video series I'm doing. It's going to be Batista versus Edge versus Chris Jericho from SummerSlam 2004. It's a short match. I think it's like, looked it up, I think it's nine minutes long. So hopefully this video won't be too long. I'm just going to like, I'm skipping all the entrances. I'm going to start with the beginning of the match. And I hope this works because I'm watching it on the W Network and the last time I tried to make one of these videos the thing started skipping and started freezing. And I'm hoping um, I can get through this whole match without any problems. Um, yeah, I'm just going to be, just gonna be watch this match, see my reactions to this match. And I'll give you my review right after the match. Okay, let's, let's get going. So let's see how he plays. I'm going to turn the volume up so see if you can hear the audio of this match. Should be a good match. I saw that um, WWE.com or WWE YouTube video page, they made this list of top five underrated SummerSlam matches, and this is one of them, so I'm going to take a look, check it out. It's in Toronto, Canada, Edge's hometown, it's going to be for Intercontinental Championship. Here we go. Okay, Batista just tossed out to the ring. Okay, here we go. Yeah, Edge out of the ring now. So it's Jericho and Batista in the ring right now. Y2J chance, hear that? I hope you can hear it. It should sound pretty clear. I think Edge is the champion for this match. I saw Batista's movie last night. Guardians of the Galaxy, really good movie. Batista looks so young in his um, in this um, match. This match is like 10 years old. So Batista would be like, what, 35 in this match? Jericho's like probably 33. I don't know what the edge is. Edge is probably like 40 in this match. That edge is probably dirty in this match. Batista has, Batista has so much hair in this match. It's so weird to see. Okay, Edge is back in the match now. Slow, slow match so far. Nothing too exciting has happened so far. So Jericho right now is outside the ring, and it's Edge and Batista in the ring. Batista's been working his whole match so far. Surprised. Okay. Spear? No. Drop kick. Okay, Batista's out of the ring. Jericho and Batista are out of the ring. What's Edge going to do? He's going to do a suicide dive? Come on, what are you going to do here? Oh, he's just going to walk in the ring, okay. Quiet crowd. It's in Toronto. You think it'd be a hotter crowd, but it's not. But the crowd, match is kind of boring so far, so I can't blame them. They're chanting something. Sounds like they're chanting, we want Christian. 
I'm not sure, but I wouldn't be surprised because Christian's from Canada too. Oh, well, here we go. Edge and Jericho in the ring together. Two Canadians. All right. Here we go. Yeah. What happened there? My network thing just like repeated or skipped. But it looks fine now. Is Chris is Edge getting booed? Holy crap. <laughs> Oh, here we go. Jericho's putting him in the walls. Walls of Jericho. No, small package. Inside cradle. Same thing. Where did Batista go? Batista's out of the ring. Oh, I just skipped. Man. Hope he's do this for the whole match. Okay, I'm going to take a break here because we're skipping again. But I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. Let's try this again. Let's hope. I hope um, I can watch this rest of this match while it's skipping or stopping or whatever. Here we go. So, Edge and Christian in the ring. I don't know where Batista is. I think Batista fell in the ring or something. It's kind of loud. Let me turn it down a little bit. I think you probably still hear it. Okay, Walls of Jericho, Edge is going to tap here, I don't, I don't know who wins this match, I forget, I don't know if I looked it up. Uh, Edge is going to try to get to the ropes here. I gotta be honest, this match is not that good so far. It's kind of boring. Hold to the point. It's a nice, like, like, rare match I've never heard of. Got some good guys in here. All these guys are going to be in the Hall of Fame. I just already there. Okay. Batista's, Batista's back now. He threw off Jericho into the ring post. So now it's Batista and Edge. Yeah, Edge getting booed. <laughs> He's getting Batista booze in this match. <laughs> Which is kind of weird because this is on um, Toronto, Edge's hometown. That's the coolest thing about this match so far, seeing Edge get booed in his hometown. Okay, Edge going for the spear on Batista. Oh, Jericho like, stopped him. I don't know why he did that. I mean, just let just let Ed spear him. Why would he stop it? Now just now Batista spine buster Jericho. So that's what you get from helping Batista. So this is Batista's SummerSlam debut, I guess they're saying. That could be true. That's nice. Uh, okay, Batista's out of the ring again. Okay, there's Jericho. Okay, made a bit. I think the match can get better now. Let's see. They want Jericho to win, I think. Yeah, Y2J chance. Jerry Large says we're in Mazzaro world, and yes, they are. I mean, Edge might be the face in this match, which is weird. He's getting booed in Toronto. I have no idea who's the heels in this match. 
Oh, that's a nice drop kick by Jericho. Oh, Spear! Spear and Edge. This is it. It's over. He got it. Edge wins. That was a quick match. And that finish came out of nowhere. I like the finish. <laughs> so Edge retains the title. Yeah, this is a not a good, really good match. Really, it's uh, too short. And not that many good spots in this match. I like the spear. Nice spear. The last, like, the last 10 seconds were awesome in this match. But the other stuff wasn't that great. I like that Jericho drop kick. I like the edge spear. Okay, I'll stop it here. So, um, I don't even want to say it's a good match because it wasn't. It was okay. If I had to rate it right now, I'll give it two and a half stars. Yeah, which would make it probably my lowest rating, rated match of the summer so far. Really disappointing. Um, yeah, nothing. That wasn't a terrible match. It wasn't bad. It just wasn't that entertaining. Too quick. Like really, like no like memorable spots in the whole match. It wasn't even a title change, so... Yeah, for a SummerSlam match, that'd be pretty disappointing. You know, it's something I worry about this year's SummerSlam. We're going to see matches like that. Matches on, that match on paper look good. You know, Jericho versus Edge versus Batista. On paper, it looks like a good match. Three future Hall of Famers. One of them now is in Hall of Fame. That's Edge. But that match, you know, didn't get enough time. I think it got like nine minutes. And it felt, it felt a lot shorter than that, even. And it just wasn't a really great match. Um, yeah. Don't know what to say about that match. You know, I wouldn't recommend it. If you want to see it, go ahead. You know, you're not gonna waste your time. I didn't think I don't feel like I wasted my time. I'm glad I saw it, but it wasn't it wasn't that great. It wasn't really that good. Um, yeah. So W W kind of lied to me about this one. It, it's it's underrated for a reason because it's not a good match. But that's okay. Well, thanks for watching. I'm gonna Paul Heyman review. I got the docu the blue right now, so I'm gonna review that hopefully tomorrow. But just a documentary and I try to watch the Blu-ray extras and review those too. Okay, thanks for watching.